I am now introducing Insane Ian. Achievement unlocked! Greetings, Internet, and welcome to another episode of A Comedy Musician Reacts. My name is Insane Ian, I'm a comedy musician and comedy music fan, and on this show I react to comedy music from the perspective of a comedy musician. Because that's what I am, and that's what this is, and that's what I do, and that's why you're here. I think. Anyway, this week I'm reacting to the brand new puppet music video by Psycho Stick called Tuesday from their 2018 album, Do. If this is your first time joining us, I'm not usually a puppet, and I think I should probably switch back. Yeah. Yeah, that was... I, I couldn't sustain that for the whole video. I wouldn't really, really be able to watch the video doing that that way. Anyway, that's a puppet video. I have a puppet of me. It's weird. Uh, anyway, uh, if this is your first time joining us, yes, I do comedy music myself. I react to comedy music specifically because I do that. And what that means to you is that I'm going to pause the video. Kind of a lot, actually. This way I can not laugh over the jokes and miss anything, but also so I can give my reaction and analysis, see how the video works with the song. And sometimes that means just sitting back and laughing my damn head off. It's a crapshoot whatever you're going to get, but I think it's a good time either way. Anyway, if you like that sort of thing, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Do all the things to feed the algorithm to get more eyeballs onto these videos. And if you really want to help the channel out, consider supporting me on Patreon, where patrons get to see these videos early, get my music and comedy early, and all sorts of other cool things like that. Anyway, whew, all of that out of the way, let's dive in. Uh, like I said, this song came out in 2018, uh, and they are just now doing a video for it. This is not the record for the longest time between a song's release and them making a music video for it. Um, I think the, uh, I can only count to four, the Numbers music video was like 11 years or something between the song's release and the music video. That was also a puppet video. Um, but, uh, 2018 is, it's 2023, that's five years or so? Something like that? I'm terrible at math. Um, but, uh, yeah, you know, it's, uh, it's a, it's a bit of time. But sometimes uh, you need to fill that time with other things. Lord knows I've made music videos well after their release, so I'm not going to begrudge them that. Anyway, love Psycho Stick, love what they do. Let's dive into this one. So that is all to say I've heard this song before. It's been a while, though, honestly. I haven't listened to Do recently. They released another album since then, so <laughs> that one's more fresh in my memory. <clears throat> Tuesday. 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 <laughs> Number one, they're great puppets. I, I love it. Uh, it just they look like the band, and it's great. Um, mine's a little more Muppet-like in that it, you know skin tone's a little different. Uh, but, uh, they, that puppet was made by my buddy, the great Luke Ski, was made for a, a puppet show of the Fumpet show, the funny music project Fump, but and regardless, uh, these puppets are great. Arms are a little short, but they're, uh, they're, they're dressed and they look like the, the, the band members. And I love Josh just Tuesday, just, <laughs> just the most unenthusiastic response to Rob's screaming. Uh, it's it's already great. I love the visuals. Just like something about putting a puppet on a green screen. That's just already inherently funny to me. Uh, so I dig that. Uh, <laughs> and I'm filming it on a Thursday right now. You know, for a little behind the scenes fun. Uh, yeah, this... <laughs> it's just funny to me. I'm gonna roll it back a little. Also, all of those synonyms for unmistakably uh, are fantastic, and that's that's just some good comedy lyricism. I've rewound it all the way to the beginning. Let's start it again. Why not? You know what day? 
I'm gonna pause it again, I'm sorry. I warned you in the beginning that I was gonna do this, so, you know, you should be prepared. Uh, that hat, Rob's hat, uh, is, the spikes on it are way bigger. And when I first did comedy, when I first started doing stand-up, 25 years ago, holy shit, um, the hat I used to wear on stage as stand-up comedian Insane Ian, completely different character than comedy music Insane Ian, uh, what looked exactly like that hat. Like, the shorter spikes. Um, and I still have it somewhere. Um, but yeah, I, I had a hat that looked exactly like that. Uh, and I don't know how big that puppet is, so it could be the same size as that hat, too. Uh, but yeah. That, as soon as I saw that, I'm like, ah, here's a neat thing. Uh, see if you can find Rob's actual hat in one of my music videos. Because the guy who directs their videos, Murph, directed one of mine. You can, you can see a, a Psycho Stick, uh, Rob's hat, in the beginning of one of my music videos. If you know which one of my videos he directed, it makes it easier. Yes. It's undeniably, indisputably, unquestionably, indubitably, undebatably, indisputably, and indubitably. Wow, that's a good rhyme there. Well done. It's undeniably, indisputably, unquestionably, indubitably, undebatably, incontestably, unequivocally, irrefutably, unmistakably. Tuesday. Tell me what's the day that comes after Monday. Tuesday. Tell me what's the day that comes before Wednesday. Tuesday. Tell me what's the day that's furthest from Saturday. Tuesday. What's the day that comes once a week? What's the day that comes once a week? What's the day that comes once a week? I mean, technically, every day comes once a week. Also, uh, puppeting Alex to drum like that, uh, uh, <laughs> sometimes you need better arm sticks. Not the drumsticks, but the sticks to control the arms. Puppetry jokes. That's what's happening. It's Tuesday, my favorite day of the week. <laughs> So they gave Maddie the giant moose hat. It's almost as big as the puppet at this point. And then there's uh, one of the puppets from the Numbers music video. So that's great too. Uh, I love this. This is just so stupid and I love it so much. I want to do a puppet video like fully like this for one of my songs. Uh, this is amazing. I'm, I'm gonna have to call Murph, because there's definitely a puppet video that I want to do now. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, uh, this is this is great, and wow. I'm, I'm smiling from ear to ear just of how ridiculous this is. I love this so much. Obligations that affect me significantly. <laughs> I also love, you can, they don't care, you can just see the arm in the puppet, like, the camera pulls far enough back that you see where the puppet sleeve ends and the human arm is in there. Whatever. Like, it could be just the short, the shirt is too short on the body. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe I'm just perceiving that as an arm. Forgetting that I know how puppets work. <laughs> also the T and the two. Uh, I think those the two it may be from the numbers video, but uh, T Tuesday two the number two it makes sense. Uh, weirdly, friend of mine, uh, my buddy Spam. Yes, his name is Spam. Uh, it's not his Christian name. It's a na nickname I gave him in high school. Uh, hates Tuesdays. So this is probably not his favorite song. Sorry, Jason. Uh, but yeah, no, this is... I love this. Let's hear it for Tuesday! Okay. Let's hear it for Tuesday! Tuesday, Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, Monday, which is Tuesday, Tuesday. The, the weird little harmony parts, like... That's what I one of the things I love about Psycho Stick is it's it's metal. It's comedy metal, obviously, clearly. But like they'll throw in like random harmonies or or melodies into the songs that don't fit the normal structure of a metal song. 
Uh, and it just makes it that much funnier. Because, you know, comedy is funny. Uh, having those kind of moments in there is just brilliant. I love that shit. Um, also, I love the weird little, like, <laughs> CG cow that, like, you know, it was clearly like, oh, here's a free asset you can buy to have as a dancing thing on your screen. Dancing cow. I was expecting a hot dog, honestly, uh, if you know Psycho Stick. Uh, but, uh, yeah, that, that, I'm loving this. Uh, this was a, uh, I'm pausing too much. Who cares? Whatever. It's a happening. albums on Tuesday. They did, and now they put them on Fridays. Uh, probably, I don't know why they switched that, but Bandcamp sure took advantage of that. Sorry, I used to work in a music store, so yeah, I remember Tuesday release days. Everything came out on Tuesdays. Albums, uh, video games, and uh, movies on DVD and Blu-ray and stuff, always, they all came out on Tuesdays. And now, just video games come out on Tuesdays. Video uh, Movies come out, I think, on Fridays also. Uh, like DVDs and Blu-rays and stuff. Yeah, I think those are on Fridays now, too. But video games still come out on Tuesdays. And on Fridays. Uh, but most, like, at least digitally, they come out on Tuesdays. That was a weird aside. All right. Albums on Tuesday. What you got going on on Tuesday? Maybe a movie. I think they have half price tickets on Tuesday. Uh, they they five dollar tickets at AMC if you're a Stubbs member. Way too much information that I'm giving in this thing. Going on on Tuesday. Maybe I wanted to see these video the, these posters. The Hand. It's a horror movie for puppets. That makes sense. Uh, it has Bruce Campbell. And is written by Chimichanga Jones and directed by Squirrel Directions. Classy. Uh, <laughs> David the Cuffney. Not David the Cuffney. David the Cuffney. Uh, executive producer Grandma. Not starring Bruce Campbell. Uh, but Bruce Campbell is something in it. I can't read the thing. Edited by another Grandma. There's the Boom Boom Room, which is Puppet Skate Presents. Duck in pants and heat-seeking killer bees. Bruce Campbell is also involved with that one. Strings attached. The romance between a man and a puppet. Or a person in a puppet human-sized costume. Kate Cloth. Edited by Hot Dog. Something by Who Knows. Where Are My Keys. And Elmo. Which is Elmo Rambo. Clearly. Uh, written by Stephen Puppetburger. Uh, some nonsense, who cares if you were the reading this, why? Because it's what I do. Sorry. Movie. I think they have half price tickets on Tuesday. What's going on on Tuesday? What's going on on Tuesday? What's going on on Tuesday? On Tuesday? <laughs> <laughs> Just the happy Alex with the, with the symbol. Not even actually drumming on it, because there's clearly no movement going on on the thing itself. It's just really above it, which is just funny to me. Uh, Animal as a Muppet is just so frantic and drumming, and you'd think Alex would be too, but his arms are a little shorter as a puppet. Uh, green screening him onto a tank is wonderful. It, uh, it makes no sense, and I love it. Uh, I love comedy music videos that have little asides in the background as jokes. Like, just as a glance, you can see them and they're funny. You pause them and you get kind of more rewarded by reading what's on them. Um, so, uh, putting that in there, as a glance, you're just seeing the posters. He's talking about movies, so you see movie posters, and that's not going to detract your attention from the joke and the lyric. That's helping to enhance that, and I always dig that kind of thing. But if you do pause it, you get rewarded with those little jokes of, who's even reading this, why do you care, and stuff like that. Um, it's a, it's a little bit different in other videos where, like, there's a huge wall of text, and you're like, well, I have to pause it now, and that interrupts the flow of the video. This keeps it nice and balanced in that area, and I dig that a lot. Favorite day of the week. Tuesday, 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 Tuesday. Up 
<laughs> random rock is the random CG dancing cow and duck now. Uh, whatever, sure, it's good. <laughs> When's I mean Tuesday. Yeah, it is like, why would you write a song about Tuesday? Only in comedy music would this actually happen. Uh, and has now, clearly since 2018 at least. Um, I It would have been funny if, uh, like clearly, rested the puppet on top of a washing machine. Um, but stock footage of laundry going through, if you put the puppet in the laundry machine, it would have been really funny to see through that window, but perhaps that washing machine that was in reality with the puppet didn't have one of those windows. Uh, not all not all the machines do. Usually in, in like, actual laundromats do you see that, but not often at the home ones. Mine doesn't have a window. And I'm not that bored to want to watch it, but it's fine. <laughs> oh man, the giant lights that spell out Tuesday. That is... That is extra... Oh, and it's uh, the beard. Uh, I, forgive me, I can never remember his name, but he's in uh, the one, a bunch of Psycho Sticks videos. Um, he's also in all of their tube videos whenever they sell the tube as part of their merch. Uh, I, can, I feel awful I cannot remember his name. Uh, I'm sure someone from Psycho Stick or someone who's a fan of Psycho Stick will tell me in the comments. But uh, he pops up and everything, and hey, love the Black Cat Amazing Spider-Man t-shirt on him. That's awesome. Uh, so random human popping up here is enjoyable. But the lights, amazing. Just production value. It's a lot of green screen, but there's so much happening in the green screen. It's enjoyable. I dig that kind of thing. I, I like green screen videos. I wish I had the ability to do them more myself. Also, that's quality. Amazing. I, I do love their merch. There's, of course, a link to uh, I Can Only Count to Four, a.k.a. Numbers. There's a tour vlog, uh, and, of course, two of the best shirts that they ever have. Uh, Dogs Like Socks, which is probably their biggest viral hit, because that pops up all the time. I just had it pop up from some dog picture Twitter account that I follow. Yeah, I like cute animals, so what? And I was like, yeah, this is a Psycho Stick song, so I tagged him. Um, Dogs Like Socks, great song. And also, from the adulting video, the Sergeant Snuggles t-shirt. Love that shirt. Sergeant Snuggles is awesome. That's the cat with the helmet on. Uh, it's from their song Adulting, which won a Logan Award, which was awesome. Uh, for, I think, I think that won for video. I don't remember if it won for video or original song. It was a couple years ago, 20, before 2018, actually. Uh, but that's a great song. I saw somebody at a Rachel Bloom concert wearing that shirt, and as they walked by, I went, Sergeant Snuggles! It was great. Anyway, uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. I enjoyed the shit out of that. Uh, if you did like it, please like, share, comment, subscribe, do all the things to feed the algorithm to get more eyeballs onto these videos. Of course, go to Psycho Stick and show the video some love as well. Link is in the description to see it without me yammering all over it and pausing it all the time. And if you really want to help the channel out, like these people over here in the credits, consider supporting me on Patreon, where patrons get to see these videos early, get my music and comedy early, and all sorts of other perks, like the credits. Anyway, that's all for this week. We'll see you next time. Thanks, everybody. Bye. There's no puppet on that hand. Start it up, cause I've got a job to do. My day begins at a quarter to the crack of noon, and then soon I'll bring you all sorts of stuff to chew. Never thought I'd have this kind of job at 42. Work where? Well, I don't want to be rude. Drop the name of my job, and I might be sued. But to be fair, I guess it's fair. You a simple name. Clue the German word for over, and what you do to food. Anyway, that's to say, though, names weirdly.